Hello, I'm Jim from Everything Yacht. Today we'll be talking about B&G's award-winning sail steer. Sail steer is packed with a ton of information. Let's start with the true wind. This is usually displayed as a default, but can be toggled with the menu. We can use apparent wind if so desired. We can have both. The yellow circle is our bearing to the next waypoint. The hourglass, not exactly shown behind the heading number, is the course over ground. That comes from the GPS fixes. The heading number that we do see, 230, comes from the magnetic heading of the boat's compass. You see we're simulating attack right now. The boat shifted from the starboard ley line to the port. Now we see these dotted lines are the actual ley lines of the wind as indicated, and the highlighted areas behind show the recent wind shifts. We just watched another tack. You can see the rudder angle at the bottom showing now a little bit of weather home. And it looks like this simulation is beating to windward as a way to get to this particular waypoint. If we wanted to change some of the data on the side, we can use our menu again. We'll go to edit. Select which data square you'd like to change. Go back to the menu. Select Info. Right now it's showing the ley line times. That's the cumulative time shown on each ley line. And I think I'm going to go down to Vessel and select Course Over Ground. Perhaps I want my bearing to waypoint directly below my course over ground. Select info again. Bearing to waypoint. Now I'm going to go back to my menu and select save. Thanks for watching.